Hello, my beautiful people. How y'all doing, my pretty people? Check out my shirt. What does it say? No one can hear you scream. Dory back. How y'all doing? What is that shirt about? Oh, I happened to get it when I went to Honduras. Uh, I was one of those crazy people that went on those zip lining things over the oceans and the woods and the jungles and, and just did that crazy thing because I wanted to check it off my bucket list has done and it's gone away but I really love this shirt so we're not going to talk about that but we're going to talk about guess what today I want to do a little video on coconut oil wow uh, this is for one of my viewers and my dearest uh, young viewers uh, Miss Eloise bonjour I wanted to do something for her so here it is this is about coconut oil what do we use it for oh my goodness I use it for cooking uh, but there's so many properties that you can use it for uh, there's uh, it has a particular acid that is actually in a lot of the ingredients and creams for wrinkles believe it or not uh, you can actually use the coconut oil and honey okay I use it with this and you can even use it for cellulite I'm gonna put it on my little I'm gonna mix it one little spoon with one little spoon of each and I'm gonna put it on one of my guess what else not only cellulite I don't have any but I have varicose veins so you can put that on as well you can put it on stretch marks um, it actually you can put it on dark circles just the coconut oil by itself you can put it around and sleep with it you can buy coconut soap and use it for washing your face. It's good for that. Not only is it good for that, but it, it takes away any bacteria that you might have. Uh, you can use it by itself or with a natural soap as well. It takes care of inflammation as well. Um, it has a lot of fatty acids. It has antioxidants. And guess what? It closes a lot of your pores. And I didn't know that. That's really good. I have big pores in my skin. And it closes that so you can use a little bit and just kind of massage it at night like you do a little cream you know don't put too much because it's really really potent okay so if you don't mind the little sweet smell of coconut then you can do that for your face now what other things do I use it for well the main thing I use it for is cooking I use it to cook when I'm making something that's gonna taste a little bit sweet uh, like cakes and things like that I put that or even if I want to make something like the meat I don't like meats a lot but I put a little bit of coconut and I can swallow it a little bit better I don't cook a lot of beets at all that's something I don't do I'm not vegan or anything but I just uh, beef and meat we don't get along too well so anyway uh, it takes care of rashes if you have a rash you can just put coconut oil on it um, so those are things that you can use coconut oil now we have a little, uh, somebody's tapping me, so excuse the little message on there. <laughs> Sorry about that, I didn't turn it off. But anyway, that is something that y'all can do. So I wanna share that with you. And if y'all noticed, I have this big giant plant. I'm gonna tell y'all, have a good day. And I'm gonna show y'all this big old plant. This looks like uh, Jack and the Beanstalk type of plant, but it has a beautiful <laughs> lily at the end of that journey. But I just decided to come out at the end of the springtime. But anyway, I'll see y'all in my next video. I'm probably going to do some uh, medical type of work because I'm going to have some medical stuff done to me. And I want to share those with you. So we're going to go into that and keep y'all pretty. So I'll see y'all soon. Have a lovely day. Bye-bye.